does my camera tell me if it's recording? What is this black magic? Anyways, hey everybody. So today we're gonna do a little fun project. Do you like my hippie band and my, I don't know what kind of shirt? Is this like grunge or, I don't know, I'm probably giving myself too much credit. Anyways, <clears throat> like $3 or $5 or something at Walmart. And this I got from Rue 21, which I don't know where there are any anywhere else, but this was only literally a dollar. It's kind of ridiculous. So, off topic, but today we're going to go through my hiking backpack and we're going to see what's in there. Um, I don't have the normal necessities that I usually do, including food and beer. Sorry, it's not in there. So, we're going to start out by showing you said backpack. This is uh, from Wally World. I think it was 20 bucks still has the tag on it. That's how much I use it. Um, recently just got this new one because it's pretty sweet. And this pocket right here unzips and you can perfectly line up beer. Just saying. So, let's do this. A lot of these are new products. I'm sorry. I was excited and ordered a bunch of shit offline. So, we got the Sola Chacha. This was $19.99 plus I think like $3.24 on shipping. That was very precise. Um, Amazon. Whoop whoop. It's a solar charger. This is great because you hang it on your backpack and it charges through the sun. Which then charges your phone. Ridiculous. I know. This is kind of something I should use in my everyday life since my phone is always dead and I'm always whiny. Sorry. <sighs> and of course, we got 7 in 1 utensils, fork, knife, spoon, corkscrew, can, bottle opener. That's like eight, by the way. Owl? What's an owl? Owl and lanyard string. I don't know where the fuck the lanyard string is. What's an owl? Oh, that's a little tiny sharp knife. Got it. It's like a teeny teeny. I'm kind of dumb. What can I say? Anyways, on to the next. Oh, this is kind of my, like, travel stuff. I'm sorry. I don't really think this was supposed to be in here. This is my neck pillow that I spent 40 freaking dollars on last time I flew from New Jersey to Washington. Wait, no, I didn't fly from... I flew from Philly. Uh, I didn't drive either. Somebody else drove from New Jersey to Philadelphia. And I flew on a plane. Anyways. These are things I like to bring camping. I bring Advil PM because I'm lazy and I can never sleep, so I want to sleep. Got some handy dandy earplugs and a sleeping mask with lavender scent. I'm a baby, what can I say? <laughs> so, I keep forgetting I put things in here for storage. This isn't really something that I would normally bring camping. Maybe zombie apocalypse camping or like the end of the world was happening. But this was a weird gift that was given to me. Um, I don't know if this person can get in trouble for it. Sorry, don't really care because shouldn't have given it to me if you can't. <laughs> this is one of the coolest gifts I've ever been given in my life. So, right here, we got a real deal gas mask. Just saying. Oh, my hippie can't handle it. Oh yeah, that's right. I just, well I guess I'm a hippie, it don't really matter, right? My hair can always look like shit. I know somebody's gonna get offended by that. I did not mean hippies look like shit. I'm just saying sometimes it gets a little messy and truthfully don't care. I have this awesome tiny tent. I have a problem. I like things, this is going to sound dirty. I like things small. Not all things, but I like my camping stuff small. Got it. Solved it, right? Um, anyways, this is a tiny, tiny tent. And I meant to get the dinosaur one, but they were out of stock. So I ended up getting the super awesome pink boxes. I'm not that excited about that one, but it's tiny. It works. You can fit two, maybe three people if you cuddle real hard. This is my literal sleeping bag. Do you see this? Put it up next to my face. 
It is so tiny. Um, this squishies down. This is a 40 degree cool weather. So, I mean, this isn't a great sleeping bag for like freezing cold areas like Washington, where I happen to live right now. But it's still pretty sweet. And I have Plan B. Not like the birth control contraceptive thing that's not a contraceptive. I don't know what it's called, but like a Plan B. Um, this right here is a keychain pillow. You hook it on. Not all it does, though. Okay, that was really awesome. This also has a fuzzy blankie in it. Super fuzzy. Fuzzy, fuzzy, wuzzy. Anyways, also has a weird pocket, which I can't remember why it comes with a pocket, but it does. I don't know, maybe it rolls into itself. Maybe I'm just not that smart. Shocker. And an inflaty. I don't think they're called inflaties, but today they are. An inflaty to put into the pillow. That's right. I also got this super awesome water bottle. Is this the right one? Yes, okay. So this is the super awesome water bottle that I think... Wow, okay. Anyways, I think I spent 15 bucks on I think it was on sale. And I didn't... Oh, my Jesus. I am not doing right today. Anyways, so there's this... Uh, cleaning pun plunger that you like whew, whew. I don't I don't really know how this works I haven't played with this too much anyways what this does I probably just ruined this by doing that I don't know I'll clean it before I use it obviously because I keep touching it so um this is like a life straw but a water bottle because I'm not gonna bend down in like life straw when I don't have to um <clears throat> and I can take it with me when there's not water so I like this idea better. If you're a life straw person, I don't mind either. I just really don't. I'm I'm lazy, and if I can bring it with me instead of like having to stop and do like squats all day, I'm good. Okay, get back in there, you double. Okay, I think we're almost done. Okay, this right here. I was like pretty stoked about this is actually a latte and it has a kachingi bottle opener that's what that's called corkscrew and a knife the sad thing about this I didn't test it when I oh my god okay well I didn't test it when I bought it and it didn't work originally but it works now so we're good I'm gonna put some fluid in it and hopefully it'll be fine and then I got this little mini tiny baby thing this was like $14.99 on Amazon. By the way, almost everything you've seen in here was from Walmart. The sleeping bag, the tent, the life straw bottle thing. It's not life straw, by the way. The lighter, the knives, and this was from Amazon. Oh, Lord Jesus, why you have to be complicated? There we go. So this is a little fuel thingy, and you cook foods on it, and it's so cute and tiny, and it's evil because it makes flame. Um... I buy little butane thingies, uh, it's not butane, it's some cook fire oil stuff. I'm having a moment today. Anyways, I buy those before I leave with this, but this is pretty sweet, and I think it was like either t 8 or 10 bucks, or maybe 50 I don't know, but it was super cheap. Um, now, normally I have a lot more stuff in there, but right now, these are like my essential items that I don't go camping without because I have learned my lesson. Just saying, if you've ever been freezing cold and mauled by a deer that walked into your tent because you were stupid and slept right next to the river, you understand my pain. But you probably haven't because you're probably a little bit smarter than me. There is some blonde. Just saying. Anyways, y'all have a good day. If you have any questions, let me know.